I see a future where a classic race car driver might feel like an outdated model. The Robocar is a fully electric, autonomous race car that could someday race at Formula One speeds. From real-time computing to artificial intelligence to computer vision, the Robocar combines some of the most advanced technologies in IT, technologies its creators hope will eventually land in your garage. We have a radar area here in the front, ultrasonics, five lidars that cover 360 degrees around the car, two GPS antennas, and we use all four wings of the wheels to create downforce. We have very low drag with very high downforce. We could technically drive it on the ceiling if somebody builds a track for us. The car's software is also critical to building the fastest car. Algorithms use the data collected by the various sensors to make the most efficient lap possible. You really need to be super efficient in the code you make because each millisecond means like meters. The team hopes that e-racing like this is the precursor to a new sport featuring several robocars racing against each other at breakneck speeds. This should be a driverless competition to where we can see who is the best uh, AI driver in the world. The team hopes to attract top talent in the fields of engineering, design and computer science to optimize the car's software and hardware for the racetrack. Motorsport makes for a punishing test for driverless vehicles, and the RoboRace team believes their work will hasten the process of bringing the autonomous electric car home to consumers. 90% of accidents happening because of the human factor. All the algorithms which will be created here for collision avoidance or to be fastest driver uh, will, will go directly to the uh, normal road cars. We need to help people to adopt the idea that robots will be on the roads. Today, probably this uh, is difficult to accept, but uh, we believe that when we'll show how robots are good in uh, extreme conditions, it's easier to accept them on the road.